So today's reference, type of clear reference, is indefinite references. And an indefinite reference is when you have a pronoun that doesn't have an antecedent. So there's nothing that it's referring to in your sentence. And remember, pronouns have to have antecedents in order to be used correctly. So commonly, the problems are you, it, they, oftentimes there. And it'll look something like this. There's going to be a meeting at noon. So you have this word there, which can be a direct pronoun, like I want to go over there. But it, in this case, it's not referring to anything, right? It's indefinite what it means. So to fix it, you need to rewrite your sentence. It would be something like this. A meeting is at noon. It simplifies it. It eliminates the extra words. On the ACT, if you have a sentence that starts with there is, you know you're going to have to fix it every time. Another example, in the book, it describes tornadoes. So I have this pronoun, right? I see this word it, and I know I look at to see what is it talking about. Well, it's talking about the book, but I've just said what the book is. So I don't need to re examine the same word from the pronoun right after it. So to fix that, I'm going to rewrite my sentence. The book describes tornadoes. It eliminates the redundancy and it eliminates the wordiness. So now you're going to try it. Um, you'll find it on Schoology under Clear Reference, Indefinite Reference Practice. And looking at the first example, that in many households in India, they serve a flat pancake-like bread called chapati. Now I see my pronoun they, and I know that they needs to refer to something specific. In this case, we don't know who they is. So you want to fix it. You want to eliminate it. All you'd have to you get rid of the and, the in as well. And so for that, it would just look like in many households in India, uh, sorry, many households in India serve a flat pancake-like bread called chapati. Problem fixed. Obviously, I'm going to have to capitalize here my M. But other than that, it looks great. So that's what you're going to do for the rest of the practice. You can submit it, and I will check it out for you. All right, have a great day. Have fun. Stay safe. Be happy. Make smart choices. Bye, all.